I've done what I can, but the rest is up to you. You need to start taking better care of yourself. Yes, mommy. I mean, doctor. <gasps> oh! Oh! Oh, shit. Sorry. My bad. Understood. And thank you. Jesus Christ. Put some locks in these doors, man. The curse has spread. Make sure she rests. Oh, no. Dude, even Tifa never g gave us that kind of fan service. Hurts, you can tell me, you know. I'll understand. I can bear it. But you shouldn't have to. Not anymore. This isn't just your struggle, Clive. It's ours. And when we see how hard you fight, it inspires us to do the same. But at what cost? Oh, would you rather we left you to save the world all on your own? No. That's not... Ignore me. Hmm? What is going on here? Okay. Of course. Hey, where are you? Of oh, freaking course. In here. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ, Gav. Not now, my. What's wrong? This is anime bullshit. Those areas under attack. <gasps> no! <sighs> so wage and everyone else. Oh no. Of course, of course, we're sorry. It's gonna be on. A Gotta be under attack. This isn't the Dalmechian army we're talking about. It's the men of the rock from Drake's Fang. Oh, okay. Hugo Kupka's private uh, guard. I was an iron blood for a sec. There is in hell in Rosalith. Trying to batter down the castle gates. Looking for me. Seems that way. Reckon old Hugo has finally worked out who Sid really is. Then this is just another trap. Ah, it's a trap, all right. The daddy of all fucking traps. I'm going to Rosaleth. You're not serious. That's exactly what he wants you to do, Clive. Look, I don't know why Kupka harbors such a grudge against Sid. But as long as it's left to fester, our world <laughs> will never know peace. It's actually your fault, Clive. He has dragged the rest of Storm into this pointless war just to find me. Beside which, I'm not about to stand and watch while my home gets ground into the dirt. It's backing through. Hugo Kuka must die. Yeah! I've lost enough friends to that man already. I don't want to lose any more. So let's go and kill the bastard. Let's go! I'm coming too. After all, we're in this together. All right. Did you not hear what Tarya said about Jill? Let her rest, my. I should probably speak to Otto before leaving. We need to know what we're getting ourselves into. Nice! Two arms, man! We're going to war! Baby Jill, sorry about that. We got blue balls again. Maybe when we're alone in this big ass bed here, maybe we can do even more than just kissing. You know, hey! Back to Rosalith then. Whatever has become of her. After all, we're in this together, right? Woo. First he wrecked our home. Now he's wrecking yours. But he's not going to get away with it this time. I sparking through. I have a lot of people to avenge. Started with Kenneth, and then Martel, and everyone else who fucking died that night. I'm gonna finish all the side quests, all the hunts before we go to Rosalie. Oh, Potha. Whatever am I to do now, Clive? Oh, Potha. I've two dresses that need stitching, but I haven't got a scrap of linen. What do you Those want me to do? Those are so threadbare. It's a wonder they don't fall to pieces. Oh, okay. 
They need a oh, makeover. I certainly cannot have that. A certain amount of decorum must be maintained, even here at the hideaway. You wouldn't want the poor things going without decent clothes now, would you? Yeah, sure, of course, of course. Of course not. What can I do to help? Oh, aren't you a dear? You see, I've paid for two bolts of cloth from the drapers in Northreach, blue and red. Mm. But they don't deliver, not to places that aren't on the map anyway, so I'll need someone to take this receipt and collect them. And you'd have this someone be me. Why I though? would. And don't let them fob you off with anything less than what I paid for. One bolt of blue and one of red. I expect them both. Wow. Dude, I'm the fucking leader of this this whole hi whole hideaway, and I'm doing these random errands for y'all, y'all. What the heck? They said they'd give us two clothes, but we've no coin. Shouldn't we have someone do that for you, like a logistics guy? What the fuck? Seems the Draper was more than eager to take my coin from Karen when last she visited Northreach, but so far, all they've delivered are empty promises. Okay, so I guess we're gonna yakuza them, huh? We're gonna loan shark those drapers. Oh, it's a crow this time. What was his name again? Jackin? Why are you jacking off this time? Why are your feathers black, Mr. Crow? Is it because you spent too long in the Deadlands? You know, if anything, I think this guy has a gift. He might be a wog. Jackin. He kind of looks like that guy from Game of Thrones as well. Maybe. Maybe. Just maybe. Yes, a talent for or skill for talking with animals. All right then. Let me check up on our this bot in his hair. Your leaves are looking nice and shiny today, Bahamil. Okay, so Bahamil, based from uh, the previous episodes I've edited, Bahamil was the chief botanist back then, the one that we saw in the previous hideaway with Martel. So that's a nice little uh, tribute to him, I guess. Right then, what do you want, Nigel? He's the new head botanist. Uh, Sid, I... I know that when we came to the hideaway, we chose to let go of our past in order that we might focus on our future. Mm-hmm. We did. I... Nonetheless... Yes, we did. I was wondering if... Well, I know you are from Rosaria, and... I'm in need of someone with intimate knowledge of those lands. Mm, that's me. Apparently, the duchy is home to all manner of curative herbs found nowhere else in the realm. Among them is a flower called a Morgan beard that increases the potency of lesser medicines. Morgan I can't beard. say that I've had much practice healing. My youth was spent in the Bailey. A shame. You see, the hideaway relies heavily upon medicines procured from afar. And when those shipments are late, our sick who suffer. If we could find this flower and learn to grow it here, we might save many lives. Whoa. However, as you are well aware, Imperial occupation has rendered the roads unsafe for those like me, untrained in the military arts. Now, I'm not asking the busiest man in the hideaway to drop everything and make the journey for me, but if you happen to be in the duchy on other business... Like killing Kupka? Sure, I mean, like, I'm I'm on my way to uh, to to fetch some laundry. So Tell why not? Of these Morgan beards, then. But of course, if my old tomes are to be believed, the flowers are bright yellow and as large as goblins' eyes. Oh, and they grow in the marshes of Sorrowise. If I am to propagate them here in the backyard. I will require several samples, preferably of blooms which have already gone to seed. Aww. And before I forget, I do seem to recall learning in the course of my research that their odor has the tendency to attract unsavory creatures. Oh, freaking course. Nothing you cannot handle, though. I'm sure. Oh, you better. Hey, nice. All right then, off we go. While we're at it, I want to hunt some monsters. Sashiburi is a suspicious character. Sid, I hear you're planning to visit another mother crystal. Just destroyed one How the other day. I hear you ask. Uh, some habits die hard, I suppose. But you don't worry. We're all on the same side now. 
our way. Or maybe it's just so convenient for you to stay here. Eh. Oh, well. I guess that's that. Taria. She is so hot. Whatever you do, don't let Jill prime. Her body can't take it. It's not... It's not up to me if she primes or not. It's not like I force her to. Whatever you do, don't let Jill prime. Her body can't take it. What if I prime her, you know? <laughs> no, wait, don't. No, that was bad. Maybe we could prime together, you know? Fire and ice. Make a Todoroki. Wouldn't be that bad, huh? Okay, let's see. We have this guy. Also in Rosaria. West of Rhiannon's Ride. And this is also in Rosaria. Damn, we actually go into Rosaria, all of us. Sheesh. Uh, okay, north of Sorrowwise. And then we got west of Rhiannon's Ride. Which do we go for first? Mm -hmm. Sorrowwise. What the, what the fuck? Where's Rhiannon's Ride? Ah, here we go. West. Somewhere around here, I guess. Alright, all we have to do is go up. North. Right then. West of Rhiannon's Ride. Somewhere around here. Perhaps unable to place. I did don't. Let's go to Marcel's resident. Yes, just before East Pole. I have seen a lot of Minotaurs there. So it makes a lot of sense. Could be around here. Or right there. Oops, sorry about that, Jill. Oh, we're getting some new travelers now. Stay yeah. shy. We don't know when those bastards will be. We gotta take a quick visit to Martha here. Martha Hisashi Buri. Never a dull moment, is there? Ask about the rest. Most folk round here. I had no idea why the garrison attacked us. They had questions and they wanted answers. So I told them everything. About what we'd been trying to do for the bearers and what the Black Shields ended up doing to them. Some took the Empire's side, said it was all my fault. That it was thanks to folk like me and the Imperials were so angry. Packed up their stuff and left. But not before we made sure we'd put the wind up them bad enough that they wouldn't go breathing a word. Reckon they'd spare you? If they'd found out you've been living in a burial haven this whole time, I said. Seemed to do the trick. Ha <laughs> Gaslighted them. Nice. Good old Martha. And on the bright side, it did get rid of everyone who ain't prepared to put their life on the line for what we're doing here. Nice way to weed them out, I guess. This town is ours. And we'd die to protect it. Every last one of us. Oh, uh, Rosaria, what's happening Lots here? Lots changed since he's pool. Feels like no way Rosaria safe no more. Probably, because they didn't. Them bastards, Black Shield's been doing the rounds of the whole province. Stringing up bearers wherever they go. I thought we already took care of the uh, Black Shield, so well. And it ain't just the bearers. Any Rosarian brave enough to object to being robbed blind is likely to get the axe in all. So folk have stopped objecting. They know what fate awaits anyone who goes against them versus soldiers, so they just go along with them. Which makes us just as bad as them. The Black Shield ain't just talking our lives, taking our lives. They're robbing us of our pride as Rosarians. What's happening in Old Hill Docks? Old Hill. Old Hill. Another atrocity to add to the list. By the sound of it, it was the same as East Pool in the Abbey. Oh, the people who got strung there, fuck. Someone was sheltering bearers. Then word got out. Founder's sake. If only we'd got wind of that what's going on before the Black Shields did, we might have saved them. Alright, then that's Come it. Come back soon, eh? I will, I will. Let me check the brothels. See what's going on. If business is still booming. Right here, you see? Jesus Christ, these guys have been... Hawking for eternity. What's going on? The Empire have dragoons, wyverns, and we have each other. What the? In a brand? Nice. Are you sure about that, buddy? 
she's probably putting up an act for you, but okay. You do you. We don't get visitors from the garrison anymore. Not that we'd welcome them. I take men to my chamber, not monsters. Ooh. Oops. Nice. Slay queen. You do you, queen. I love Martha like a sister. You know I do. If this is going to end up turning into another East Pool, we should leave while we have the chance. Can't blame them. Absolutely cannot blame them for fearing what might happen. Please, teach me how to fight. Alright. If you're still here when my shift is over, I'll spar with you. Aww, that's so cool. Start them young while they're all fired up. See, it's always nice to go around a village. Check on the NPCs. Not but wild beasts, this end. All their twisted talons and. Yeah, it's good, it's good, it's all good, it's all good. Let's go. Because all. Ambrosia, let's go! Nice! Appeared right from the fog, she did. Is that it? Is that him? Could it be? Yep, it is. Let's go! Cut! Yeah! Exactly the music I wanted. Suck! Fucking with a guy. Wow, you did another rush. Stuck. Do it right, boys. Yeah, shoot me down! I want up. Oh man. Oh, what are you? Ah! Nice. That was fun. Could have ended it like quickly, but you know I me. Mean. Easy. Show your dick. There you go. Without him there, guys. Hmm. 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 The guy. All right. Next up, uh, Sorowise? Somewhere north of Sorowise. Ready. Are we ready for this? Probably. Let's go then. Give me an epic soundtrack for this battle. Straight home now. Come on, give me. Come on. Yeah! Alright. Time to take this seriously. Hoi! A bit of a delay there, but okay. Uto! Uto! Nasty bastard. Uto! 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 Bow down before me! Son, let's go Eat that! What are you doing? What the? What the? Eat that! Oh, 
8m! ボルトナイスおっと2ロットバーター2ロットバーターいいぜあっみんながWe could have ended with Judgment Bolt, but hey, <laughs> couldn't take that smoke. And we got the Electrum we needed. Let's go! From the ruins it came, and to ruin it returns. Not too shabby, Clyde. Not too shabby. Dun, 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 dun. The marsh is near the Abbey is certainly damp. Let's see if they're damp enough for Morgan Beards. Don't worry, don't worry, it's over, it's over, it's over. Yeah, yeah, it's this. Here they are, Morgan Beard. Bright yellow. These are our Morgan Beards, all right. Nice. Well, I've gone to this much trouble. Might as well gather as many as I can. Get everything. Nice. There's something familiar about this scent. It reminds me of home. Aww. Of course it does. Hopefully this will be enough. I've had my fill of goblins. I spark it. We haven't fed Thorgal yet. Come here, boy. After it. Come here. There you go. There you go. Good boy. Alright, we are done with our missions here. Time to go back to the hideaway and talk to... Uh-oh. 
Oh shit, we haven't gone here yet. Fuck. Oh, you know what? We haven't really paid the visit to um what's his name again? Quinton. For the past five years, so let's catch Oh, it's not Quinton's place. Eh, never mind then. Oh wait, forget about <sighs> Quinton. How so about the Draper has Hortense's cloth? How about the dame? We haven't really uh, talked to the dame yet in a while. Citizens are free to come and go as they please. Checkpoint's open to all. What? What happened? We'll finally, it'll be on Northridge, though. When the throne moves south, most of any sense followed. Oh, okay, that's cool. They're not that strict anymore. But is business booming here in Did the... Hear? The gates to heaven the and the airy were breached by someone. Or something. The steward was in town earlier looking for men to come and repair it. But no one was keen to help. Is that so? We don't have any side quests here, so we're all good. Hey, the musician's still here. So the gold owed its luster to the great mother's light. Mark the sighing of the meadows as the day. Five years, uh, five years, nothing much changed except for the crystal not being there anymore. Good detail. Hey, Sashiburi Dana, Isabel. What a pleasant surprise. What's happening? The realm may have changed, but her people remain the same. Ever driven by their appetites, many of which we here at the Vale are happy to sate. <laughs> and if during the satiation they would they should prove inclined to unburden themselves of certain confidentialities, well, we certainly cannot stop them, just as they cannot stop us from sharing that information with our most intimate companions. Mm -hmm. That's a good information network. <laughs> Even in Game of Thrones, like uh, one of the uh, what do you call it? the information brokers there owned a brothel. And you know how some men like to fucking uh, reveal their secrets, you know, for pride towards their hookers. Yep, bed talk. Huh. I will admit. I did worry that the Imperial Court decampment to the Dominion might be bad for business. But as it happens, what custom we lost in nobles and diplomats. We gained in board, in board soldiers, and there are no lips looser than those of a board soldier. That is fucking true. I fancy yours, meanwhile. Might be a little too tight. Perhaps one of my girls could help you with that, or maybe you yourself could loosen it up. You know what I mean, Isabel? You can't really say that in front of Jill, though. What's happening here? Before there was a North Reach. There was the wall, a last line of defense shielding the capital and her farmsteads from anyone foolish enough to try and claim Fuck. them. As a wise man once said, a wall is only as strong as those who stand atop it. And so the empire at attached a garrison to the gate. A garrison replete with vigorous young soldiers, pockets bulging with gill. Of course, there are few things that set a merchant's eyes to sparkling the than a man who doesn't know if he's going to live out the week. And so a bakers and bards, tinkers and tailors gathered from afar and wide to lighten the purse of a loyal pikeman. Alas. Everything that was once guarding has either been packed off to the south or lost to the floods, leaving our brave boys to languish and idleness. Defenders of naught. Hey, at least you guys are keeping them company. So what happened here? What's the, what are the changes? Not everyone left the capital. When the emperor ordered his throne carted off to the dominion, but enough departed to change the empire for good. Had Drake's head remained, the fewer may have followed. But without a mother crystal, Oriflame could no longer sustain the industry upon which her citizens depended. The nobles were all but forced to shutter their manufactories forcing the markets to close in turn for lack of custom. In a few short moons, Oriflam and Northreach went from being the crown of the empire and the ermine around its neck to a vertebral ball and chain. And now many of us have begun to wonder why we're still here. The veil does what it can. But our patrons' hearts are heavy and many are quick to anger, occasionally, and most vexingly, at the expense of my poor girls. Aw, that sucks. Do stay out of trouble. She hasn't aged a bit. Or an oil of talc. Still no caravan from the Dominion's perfumeries yet, then. 
least Amicia is good. Seeing as business is scarce these days, the dame decided we should all learn to read. That is fucking cool. I only wish she had some smaller books. My arms ache something fierce. <laughs> Time was there were great coin sacks swinging from every belt in town. Not anymore. Since the capital moved, they're all shriveled to the size of peas. Yeah. That's tourism ain't that booming. What about the bearers here? Hey, y'all up for round two? What was that you guy? Want a spot on the Dominion walls? You'll need to do better than that. Hmm. 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 Tang ina nga a bobo. That's what boredom does. And they're still using bearers. Come on, Clyde. You should have freed the bearers here. All those five years ago. Come on, man. There's nothing much has changed. Huh. The wheat is still striving. So I guess it's not that bad. Is it? How many travelers heading north these days? What with the fields, Baron? And the penitent's gate closed? Hmm. Hey yo, give me my drapes, Draper. Might I interest you in some swans down? Perhaps some seersucker or herringbone. Just some linen. Two bolts. Already paid for in full. Here you go. Here's the receipt. Apologies, my lord. But your items aren't here. And why is that? They were that? due to arrive on a caravan from Bucklad, but there's been little traffic on the road these past few days. Bollocks! My mother thinks it might be bandits, but she always thinks it's bandits. It usually is. So I assume the caravan will be coming from the south. Yes. Hopefully carrying all manner of spice and sundries. Wait, you aren't thinking of... Going to find it. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Oh. Well then, be safe. May I assume that whatever I find in the caravan is all mine to loot? Hmm? You could just wait for the caravan at the Vale. I see you wear the dame's brooch. They'd welcome you, wouldn't they? Nope. My people are freezing. I gotta go there right now. Fly, Ambrosia, fly! Not glide. So, were that they pillaged by... A menace. She meant nothing by it, I swear. So it wasn't... It wasn't the bandits. It's just a bit of all uh, traffic squabble. Okay, then. You deserve a rest. Well, 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 what's all this, then? Who's gonna buy my wares now? State your animals left them in. But they hardly damage us all. Is there something wrong? If you're a bandit come to steal my staff, you're going to be sorely disappointed. <laughs> and all thanks to this fool. But it, it was you who stepped into my path. Yeah, yeah. Only after that feather brain trampled me, I demand recompense, be it in coin or the items you carry. Refuse, and I shall report you to the garrison and see you hanged. Uh, these th these goods are expected in Northreach. I mean, they're not mine to give away. You Show me the dash cam footage. Let's see you? what happened. Uh, I, I am, but um, did someone from the market send you? Please, please, you have to help me. I, I can pay whatever you ask. So the fool has protection and coin too. Sorry, friend, but we'll be the ones taking it. Oi, killer! It's time to collect. So he is a bandit. I told you not to call me that. And we'd have already collected if you hadn't insisted we'd put on this little That's act. fucking true. <laughs> Bandits! As I told one of your customers, it usually is. Let's get this over with. Koi! I'll deal with the bird lover. You take the handsome one, killer. Eat that. Damn, dude. Okay, did not expect that. Ooh, so. dun, 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 dun. Ooh, that and I was pressing R1. I hate these guys. 
Keep doing, keep going, keep fucking going, buddy. Keep going, just keep going, keep going. There you go. Judgment balls. 41k damage. That's a new record, guys. Oh, puta, I don't want to Eat this! Okay, I'm gonna parry you. Hmm, tak ina ka? Hmm, 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 hmm. Nah, bro, it just got tilted. That's what. Easy clap. Easy clap. All right, all right. You made your point. Killing my ass. Where are you going? You should the be killed you. as well. No, no, thankfully. He seemed intent on letting the bandit do his dirty work for him. And he would have succeeded had the great lender not sent you. My shipment is safe and my livelihood with it. You must allow me to reward you. Give me all your we goods. Speak I'm the bandit now. Safe in Northreach. I'll accompany you there. Damn, we even fixed the cart. Clive has a lot of time in his hands. So you and my mother were right. It is always bandits. Of course it is. Right, not for the kindness of our free sword here. You'd be buying your order back from them at twice the price. Now, if you don't mind, I have a pressing appointment at the Vale before my return to Boklad. <laughs> Farewell. You go on then. Oh, I almost forgot. I suppose you'd be wanting your linen. You'll be happy to know both bolts arrived safely along with the rest of the delivery. I've also added a few extra lengths of our finest fabrics to the bundle. Thank you. Free of charge. The draper is kind of cute, not gonna sure? lie. She is My mother would insist. It's the least we can do for the man who saved our shipment. Nice then. How's that done then? Now it's back to Hortense with her cloth. There was a time when cloth like that would have commanded a king's ransom. But now all the nobles have moved south and there's no one left to buy it. Nero Hodor, that's good. I wish we could have an appointment to the Vale ourselves. Release some tension if you know what I mean. Fresh cuts. Alright then, here you go. Here's your order of linen. Clive, sorry again for sending you all that way. But you did get my order, didn't you? Yep. Don't worry. I have it. I believe this will more than satisfy your needs. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's go. What? what? Crimson. Oh, cool. Let's see here. One bolt of red, one bolt of blue. And some extra stuff. What's this? I don't recall ordering any silk or velvet or... Is this gold work? Gregor's ghost. Damn. If that devil of a draper expects me to pay for these. You needn't worry on that score, Hortense. They were a gift. For services rendered. Nice. I can always return them if you like. Oh, no. Oh, there's no need to be hasty now, Clive. I'm sure I can put all three to good use. Speaking of which, which one's most to your liking? Hmm. I don't know. Oh, tough choice. Tough choice. White continental silk, lush red velvet, black embroidered linen. Oh my goodness, everything's like my favorite color. Black, white, and red. Oh, no. But if you ask me, I'm more of a black person now. But white looks fucking nice too. But you know what? We'll go here. Black embroidered. This one, I suppose. Have a mind to give a piece to Jill. Did you know she's quite the little seamstress? Ooh! I know Needlecraft was amongst her lessons at the castle. Her lessons? Oh, that's right. The two of you were raised together in Rosalith, weren't you? Not quite together, but... When my father put down the uprising in the Northern Territories, 
Jill was taken as a ward to ensure that her father, the Silvermane, would keep the peace. The Silvermane? What happened? She's an honest to goodness princess, then, isn't she? I could tell, you know. Some people just have that air about them. Not many round here, mind. That's fine. I'd cool. offer to sew her something that might better suit her station. But she'd most likely turn me down, as she always does. Tell me not to waste the fabric when it's better used on the children. Don't take it the wrong way. She certainly seems to be attached to the last outfit you made her. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes I think she never takes it off. That is fine, too. <laughs> Or perhaps she'll make something for herself with your gift. Either way, I'm sure oh, she won't turn it down. Shit. We'll see, I suppose. Oh shit! Could be. You know. Remember in FF7 when um uh when we were made the choice of which outfit Tifa would wear. Maybe it's the same here. Like, why would we even? Why would this side quest give us the choice to choose the linen, if not to choose the lingerie? That a little old Jill will walk. Ooh, damn, dude. She might she might make a good ass nightgown with that black linen. Oh, I can imagine her right now. Sheesh. White cloth, puta, velvet. What else are you supposed to use with the with those? Those are those are drapes used for making lingerie. Ooh, damn, I cannot wait. I think I made the best choice there, guys. I think Jill looks so freaking good in black. Oh, man. Lady good stuff. Was good stuff. Soon. Said they'd be made of linen. Not sackcloth. I've never had a dress made of linen. Oh, it makes so me proud sad. to see her wearing my dress. I only wish she'd let me make her more. Her cosplay is pretty good. Not gonna lie. All right then, let's now deliver one day the other I will sail all the way to the shore. You have to remove your mark first. Or the child catchers will get you. Are you guys allowed to do Okay, you know what? Doesn't matter. Hello Torgi. Oh, he's warmed up to the children. That's so nice. Oh, yeah, by the way, Blackthorn, here's the electrum you wanted. So, what it be? I need to craft this. The Dark Slayer's belt with the Electrum. No scratches, right? Hi, Sotis, yo. What was that again? Morgan's beard. It is rare that we see you so often in the backyard, Sid. What brings you to the gardens? Morgan beard. The rare flora has the unfortunate honor of being named for the water spirits that are believed to haunt the swamps of Eastern Storm. Trapping hapless wanderers in the moras that they might sup on the hope in their hearts. Infusions brewed from the flower's petals, by contrast, are quite tasty and known to cure all manners of ailment. I found your flowers. Thank yes, you. Yes, yes, wonderful. These are almost identical to the plates in my tongue. Did you have any trouble locating them? Absolutely Finding not. Finding them was the easy part, but it's odd. They remind me of my childhood somehow. I don't remember these flowers specifically, but you must have grown them in the castle garden. And it was a if the petals are meant to improve garden. the effectiveness of medicines, it's possible that the core physicus grew them for the tinctures and treatments they made my brother. If the ducal healers were convinced of their properties, that is all the more reason to begin growing our own supply here. Oh, allow me to use some of the flowers you brought me to make something that might aid you on your travels. I need only a moment to extract the essence from the petals. A better potion, perhaps? And here we are. Aww. A file of pure Morgan Beard extract. A single drop added to any one of your restoratives will increase its potency. At least I hope it will. We don't need that though. We don't even we don't even use potions anymore, guys. It's either I die or not get hit at all. Morgan beard extract, huh? Whatever. Eh, thank you. Consumable potency enhanced. 
That's great, I guess. Thanks, mate. You have obtained a file of Morgan Brewed Extract here by increasing the potency of the most of most consumables. Uh-huh. Oh, cool, cool. Long before our forefathers came to lean so heavily on the mother crystals, they knew the secrets of the land and how to coax her blessings from the soil. It is these same techniques that we employ here in the Deadlands, and they have yet to fail us, despite the doubts of some who visit us here in the backyard. <laughs> right, then let's continue. Oh boy, I am excited. We're gonna go off to war. This could be. This could be. Let us know if you find it. This could be the moment that we face Hugo Kupka. They all be better ready. Y'all better be ready. Ang bagal mo live. Come on. We must be ready to leave for Rosalith at a moment's notice. Yep, yep, yep. Don't worry. Everyone's prepared. Fuck yeah, everyone's prepared. Help you today, Clive. Give me something. Come to claim your just desserts. Yes. What is this? Cleric's medallion. They say it's your men who keep the roads free of beasts and bandits. As one whose livelihood is reliant on safe passage from market to market, my chocobos and I thank you. Hey, right. Oh, you go. All right, Otto. Let's do it. Gov gave you the news then. Hey. We're hey. leaving for Rosalith, but not before I know exactly what's going on. What have we heard? All sorts. Nobody was expecting the Delmax to open up a new front against the Empire, least of all our friends in the provinces. Reports have been rolling in from all over the place, with no two saying the same thing. I've been passing them on to Vivian, in the hope she can make sense of them. If you set on going, you'll want to talk to her. Understood. Yeah, of course we're gonna to talk to Vivian. Vivian's got all the information you need. Just don't do anything stupid with it. Of course not. Who do you take me for? <laughs> Vivian, my girl! Uh, if it isn't my favorite pupil. Let's see now. Where did we leave? Well, this is a surprise. My lectures are rarely so well attended. We're off to uh, war, you know Vivian. what they say? A little knowledge. Uh, can't hurt? We are going to Rosalith to deal with Kupka. What's the situation there? <laughs> Whoa there, Lord Rossfield. I'm sure you're champing at the bit to return to your roost. But to fully understand the present situation, one must first understand how it came to be. Do it. I'm ready. Let us begin with the story of Hugo Kupka, or the permanent economic advisor to the Dalmekian government, to give him his formal title. In a republic founded on commerce, there could hardly be a more influential position. It has granted him both extraordinary wealth and extraordinary power. Not that he ever wanted for the latter. Being Titan's dominant, he is also Dalmekia's last line of defense. A fact he has used to his considerable advantage. Why, he was even able to pry Drake's Fang, one of the pillars of the Republic, from Parliament's grip. And he was quick to buy the loyalty of the Fang's protectors. Today they are his faithful creatures, a private army in all but name. The self-same army that marches upon Rosarian soil as we speak. By which I mean imperial soil, not that you need reminding of the fact. Uh -huh. Suffice it to say, the Empire's attentions are elsewhere at present, deadlocked as it is with Dalmechia over its occupation of the Crystalline Dominion, where its legions are now gathered. Scarcely a handful of garrisons remain to secure its western provinces, and half of them left after the fall of Drake's breath. With the threat of the Ironblood thus diminished, they had little cause to fear a maritime invasion. And Aww. so today, only a token force guards the former duchy's shores, as Kupka was quick to descry. 
he landed his troops on the Rosarian coast without encountering so much as a single what ship. What is our uncle doing? All for you, Clive. Damn. He wants your head. And so he and his men advance upon Rosalith, not to capture the province, but to draw you out. And he will get what he wants. You said Kupka's forces sailed up the coast. What of Port Isolde, then? Yeah, what happened there? Is the city safe? Quite, according to the Guardians of the Flame. The Dalmechian fleet floated by without incident, but not without remark. When they learned Kupka's forces were making for Rosalith, our friends were quick to begin arranging the exodus of her citizens. And so okay. the stage will soon be set for your heroic homecoming. Alas. It will be a more trying task to enter the capital than it was to leave it. Hugo's men hold Buett Bridge, despite the Imperials' repeated attempts to wrest it back from their grasp. And they were careful not to repeat the Empire's mistake in neglecting their coastal defenses. The seas around Rosalith are firmly under Dalmechian control. So tell me, pupil mine, what do you believe to be the best route to Rosalith? The north. The north? We cross the northern border near Phoenix Gate. Then take the road through Stillwind down to the capital. Hardly the quickest route, but at least we won't be spotted. A little local knowledge goes a long way. And so must you. We'd best get a move on then. Oh. And Gab's coming with Will us? Will you be going too? I? I've been waiting a long time to give that fucker a taste of his own medicine. I would have missed this for the world. All right. We should be on our Let's way. Let's hope it's not your last, Lead Gav. On. You know, people should... Someone should give Gav an eye patch. Just so that he, he looks cooler. But that's not his character. Gav is more of a comedic relief guy. So putting an eye patch on him... Eh, it could be... Uh, Goro Majima was a badass comic relief character so I don't know so these are the northern regions right here nothing there apparently so let's just go go to Rosalis let's go right now fuck them all up oh my goodness they are feeding it oh Jesus is anyone even left there fucking dull mix I'll kill you all. All of you. Fortify the castle gates at once. Fortify? You're destroying it. What do you mean? Bobo? Dun 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 dun. Hugo and his men have been busy. They've already dun, dun, breached the castle's outer wall. Da, da, da. The Imperials are holding the ground for now, but it's only a matter of time before the keep falls. Those Wait. fuckers really went to town on this place. Almost like they want to wipe it off the map. Just the means to an end. I think it's probably just whack it. All this for one man? They didn't have to go so far. If you keep your wits about you, I reckon you can make it up to the castle without raising the alarm. I'll sniff out any townsfolk who haven't escaped yet and send them on the way. Be careful. Likewise. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Careful now, Gav. So the Imperials are still defending this castle? Kinda? Oh no, the people! Oh, they are! Jesus! Come on, Clive, you can't leave them. Fuck. Can't do shit. I thought I was ready for this, but... 
I know. It's like a nightmare. This was our home. Come on, Clive. We have to keep going. Hello, Torgi. I was wondering where he went. Come now. Capital punishment. Let's go! This isn't an invasion. It's a massacre. He'll stop at nothing, Clive. Nothing. Jesus Christ. Parkour through here, what do you mean? Look, a filthy dull neck. Kill them. Protect. Some opponents will cast Protect spells to raise defense. When engaging protected targets, avoid using your sword and instead employ magic to quick, quickly and efficiently dispel the barrier. Like this? <laughs> This punishment, judgment of Fanta! Who can anyone on that? What effect can say, oh? Damn, that protect is something else. It feels different. I think it's like an immunity shield. Doesn't matter if it's like the, the lightning of Ramu. It will protect ya. Oh god. I yield! I yield! Ah! Oh, yeah. Just try to fight back at least. There, boy. Okay. Come on, Snake. Uh. Bow down before me. Oh, 
보보 Even recognize this place. Sheesh. Alright, let's go. Oh, these poor people. in judgment if I say so myself. It ends there. Dude, if we're gonna have a Titan battle here with Kupka, he's gonna destroy the whole fucking thing. He's as big as a castle. And well ain't my problem anymore. We good, we good. Can't say the same for you guys. Set her loose. Set her. Oh boy. Oh, coral. I've always wanted to try and beat another one. Oh. Down, boy. Down, boy. You'll get your chance. Attack! Ready? What do you think? Stay out of its lightning. God damn. Malik. Oh, Malik. Oh, 
Let's make this count. What the? Get that! Get that! Get that! Too slow. Love me some co worlds. Ah! Jill! Jesus Christ, Jill, come on. Can't believe we you got your last sin. How did you let him do that? Or should I say, Lord Rosfield? I've been looking for you for a very long time. Let her go, Kuka. <laughs> I'm so glad you accepted my invitation. I went to some trouble with the decorations. Do you like what I've done with the place? Bastard! You better look forward to what I'm gonna do Such to your a face. Pity your predecessor couldn't join us. But I am sure you will prove compelling company. Mm -hmm. Get your filthy hands off her. Be still, little snowflake. I would not have you melt before your starring moment. Oh. What do you mean, Clive? What do you mean, fuck? Seriously, dude? You're just gonna let yourself get caught like that? Bro! This is dumb! Now, on to the festivities. Bro, he has- he won! Coop, go on, just like that! Orgo, don't go, go, ask for help. There you go. Good job, buddy. Hey, good of them to uh, that's just great. My sword. That is, I suppose it's up to me then. Good old guy to the rescue, of course. Now, what, dude? That is so fucking dumb. Coop, go on. That's it. He could have just killed Clive there. Oh, man. What else does he want? A public execution? Is that it? Headsman! Oh, no. Where 
Where do you want me? You! Bring the prisoner! <laughs> yeah, it's no more than she deserves for getting into bed with an outlaw. <laughs> we should get into mine. Shut up. Lord Kupka commands your presence. You're to bear witness to the girl's execution. Such a waste. <laughs> oh, let's go, Gav! <laughs> Mommy! Gav! Shh! Crystal fetters are a bastard to open, just so you know. Don't worry, I'll have them off before you can blink. Where's Jill? In the courtyard. Shit. We have to hurry. The Imperials have sounded the retreat and cleared out of the castle. But the place is still swarming with Kupka's men. Leave them to me. I'll make my way up top and circle round the back. Quick as you like, eh? Ah. You're sorry. Nearly forgot. Good lad. Good lad. Hold on, Jill. I'm coming. Where would he be without Gav? You know, of course something like this would happen. To get to the courtyard. So stereotypical. But hey, without this stupid dumb moment, Gav wouldn't have his awesome moment. Jesus Christ, Gav, good job. Don't you let her die. Oh, this is a familiar place. You've got a plan, Clive, because we are fucked if you don't. Where's our boy Torgo? Torgi. There he is. Good job, boy. Good job. Go, go. Yeah, let's go! New Torgi can do that! Holy shit! Angelo got nothing on Torgi! Whoa! He's primed, boy! Holy shit! Jill, can you stand? What a fine hound he is! Come, come, Lord Rosfi. Don't tell me you tire of my entertainment. Enough! Yes. Perhaps it is time we served the main repast. I trust you are hungry! Dude, my fucking Digimon can take y'all on. Stay close. We're getting out of here. And Toggle, thank you. I don't know what fucking icon that is, Torgo, but keep doing it, buddy. Judgment! Oh! Later, everyone, with me. That includes you, Torgo. What is happening? What the fuck is happening? 
a good boy still breathing are you excellent then lord kopka's reward shall be ours flashing all right Oop. sorry god you get the other one in the had to use a potion there or else we're gonna break immersion it's over for now Thorgi, what happened to you clive's faithful friend who is fiercely protective of him and his allies when jill came close to death in the courtyard of rothalis castle something awoke within him transforming torgal into something akin to an acon what is he though? Is he Carbuncle? Is he Sir? I don't know, man. His powers are actually kind of mysterious. Hmm. Hmm. What do y'all think? But I bet that wasn't the last of them. And they won't stop hunting us until Koopk is dead. So you get in there and finish the job, eh? Go on. If they come again, we'll hold them back. Can I bring All my right. best boy with me? But be careful. Yeah, it explains why Torgal is not affected by Aether Flood. That is fucking true. Can I still pet you though? Torgi, are you still my best boy? Of course you are. Yes, you are. Look at him. He's a fucking Zoid. Holy crap. Looking cool, Torgi. Kupka took our home, Clive. Don't let him take yours. Don't worry about us. Go. Will do. Igzar. Wait. Fenrir? What's Fenrir a thing? You'll die by my hand. We know, we all know Fenrir is a wolf, but was he, uh, is he actually a Fenrir Fenrir from Final Fantasy? Been wondering though, can you refund the ability points, like for the skills you don't use? Um, good, good question. Might as well do everything now before we start to blue balls you guys, but you gotta be prepared for this one. Oh, we can reset all abilities. Oh, nga, no. We can, holy shit. Whoa. Yo, that is cool. That is fucking cool, dude. Yep, that's pretty much it. We done. Good investment, good investment. Yosh. You guys are. You're late. Trouble on the way. Hey, at least he's not sitting Just on my dad's throne. enjoying your entertainment. How gratifying. Now have you come to defend your father's throne, Lord Rosfield? 
<laughs> the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. A realm without a ruler, an army, even a people. A veritable kingdom of dust. Truly, I see no throne to defend. Yep. No! Come on, it's just a throne, Clive. Let it go. Kind of like disrespecting Enough sound death. of your games, Kupka. Just tell me what you want. Sit's head in a box. Imagine my disappointment when I learned that he met his end at the hand of another. And my relief to learn that you had taken up his thrice damned name. Your master slew Benedicta Harmon and defiled her body. If you choose to bear that murderer's name, then you shall answer for his crimes. The only crimes I shall answer for are my own. Sid did everything in his power to save that woman, though she was long past saving. And so I did what he couldn't. It was me all along, Hugo. It was... you. You... you killed her. Damn that twitch in this girl. I did. And I enjoyed it. Let's go, Thanos. Then Let's go. I am fortunate indeed. I had thought the most I could wish for was to take the life of one he loved, just as he did to me. But it seems I was wrong. And I shall have my revenge. Same here, buddy. We shared a dream. I would be the king of the world. Your she bit. would be my queen. And together, we would be like the gods we are. But you would rest that you will to dust. Cool. Oh god, oh god, oh god. No! I did not even. Fine. We'll settle this like men. The Elden Lord is shit. Bow down to me! He 
Dream. You want this, huh? The same cloth that your lover put in your ass? Oh, Tangina, this is not getting me anywhere. But <laughs> my controller's gonna get wrecked before we even fucking. Get... <laughs> I'm sorry, but as y'all could see. I am more than capable of destroying Koopka without icons. It's just, it's gonna take a lot of time. I'm sorry, mate. Sorry about that. I forgot to equip my icons. I did. I mean, take two. Let's go. Maybe it's a cannon event. All right, we get it. Ooh, tangi na ka. Eat it. Give me Titan. I'll make good use of him. Follows up with a kick. Yep, I knew it. Follow up with another kick, Tabi Naba. Oh yeah. And he follows up with a kick. Good. Got your move, buddy. With another kick. Yatta! We'll do a better combo next time, don't worry. You will die by my hand, Rossfield. My hatred for you is unending. A real thing. Full prime then, full prime. Full prime then, full prime. Didn't do much. Oh, come on, Koopka. You gotta be more than that, buddy. Come on. Let my forefathers bear witness to this duel. Is that all that Titan does? that all that ca Titan can do. <laughs> Damn, bro. Oh, no wonder Benedicta wanted more, wanted Odin's dick than yours, dude. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, God. Excuse me? Yeah, oh. Caught you in 4K, bitch. You follow up with another one? Yep, he does. Oh! Fucking mom. What the? Okay, 
follows up with another one, two, three combo. Good though. One more. Uh huh. Step on him. Kills, buddy. doing its thing. What the fuck are you doing? Just like oh. your fathers. Your journey ends. Imada! Ball would do it. 
Definitely not. That one HP uh, clutch. Sheesh. Oh, come on, Koopka. Come on, man. That can't be it. That was lame, bro. You sucked. Give me Titan. Give it to me. I'll do a better job. Owarita. Raina. Jesus Christ. Ooh. Come on, Clive. Ooh. Cut his hand off there. Pretty sure. There you go. Didn't have much use for them anymore, though. Can't fap, can't do anything with it anymore. Poor dude! I don't think you need your head either! Give it to me! Go kill you! Ooh, ouch. Go kill you! Go kill you! Oh, come on. You should have full prime. The beginning, dude. I'll fucking kill you, dude. That's my line. Wait, what? There, there. You mustn't get yourself worked up. Holy crap, Wait. what? Another time, Mythos. He knows! He fucking knows! The Lord Commander of Walud! The Targaryen! Damn! He's like one of those. What was that? The angels from um, Dragon Ball? Gav! Nice one, Torgi! Good boy! Is that all of them? Good Digimon. I think so. Well, Luda scum. Who the fuck invited them? Not that that's the biggest surprise we've had to do. Where did you learn to do that toggle? <coughs> Not and telling to you. Blessing. Suit yourself. Gav, we have to find Clive. Right, sorry. <sighs> Oi, 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 oi! No! Gav! Ah, <laughs> oh, thank God. Jesus Christ. You missed one. We were worried. So was I. Come on, pet Torgel. Pet him. Pet the little boy. No? Okay. I was so close. If it hadn't been for my gift, I would have finished him. I'm just glad you got out of there alive. Well, when did the royalists arrive? Right after you went inside. Just when we thought we were shot of Titans lot. In pile Odins. Not enough of them to worry us though. No. You didn't see the one who took Kukra away. So, what? You think they came here to save him? Why though? I'll be fucked up. I know what's going on, but every minute we spend racking our brains, that bastard's getting further away. Yeah, 
At least you got Titan powers. So what now. do we do? We go back to the hideaway. I'm too tired to think. As are you, by the looks of it. And after what Jill's been through. Let's worry about Kuka later, shall we? Mm-hmm. I... All right. It'll give us a chance to solve the riddle of your magic mud, too. Still on. Woo! Bam! We freaking did it! Shush! Can't believe the Lord Commander of Walud took Kupka right off our hands. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, there's just something funny about some big ass burly dude without hands. Fucking dumbass. Anyways, let's do. Let's go. Clive did a goem on on him. Remember, if if you guys have watched um, Looping the Third, that spin-off movie with. Goemon, he did the same thing with that lumberjack. Just look at the state of you. You're more of a wreck than this place. Mm -hmm. Is this what you call taking better care of yourself? No more excuses, your ladyship. I order you to rest. Yeah, yeah. Fine. I'll rest. Can't go against Lady Tarya. Don't worry, Gav. She's in good hands. But we should have never let her fall into Hugo's. Back when he had some like. <laughs> the question is, where is he now? And what the hell were those wireless doing there? Hmm. I was wondering about that all the way home. Otto may have heard something. I'll talk to him. And I'll talk to Tomes. The Lawsman. About what? About your faithful hound for a start. Exactly, dude. What if is any four legged he? friends ever done that before? I'm betting Tom's will have read about it. But what I want to know is what happens afterwards? It's all well and good Toggle saving our asses, but if it costs him what it costs Jill. Oh, exactly. Oh my god, right. I wasn't thinking that. Let me know if you learn anything. Oh, thank you, Gav. Will do. And you do the same, eh? Good lad. Good lad. Jill, listen to Taya. I will. Thank you. No, I'm, I'm, I'm really curious about Torkel, but I never really thought about him. Uh, what do you call it? Succumbing to the curse. Or the same curse we're, that we're experiencing. Clive has claimed a portion of the Akon Titan's essence. The tuning with Titan only changes the elemental aspect of Clive's magic spells. And bit, 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 bit. we got Royal Guard. Royal Guard. This is nice. I like this. Which leads me to. All right. Here's the thing. Okay. Here's the thing. So, uh huh. Titan channeled. There you go. I want the aura, aura, aura. Where's the aura, 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 huh? Where's the aura, 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 aura? No, not that. No, not that. Here's the aura, aura. Okay. Wind up. There you go. Looks good now. Sorry, Sid. Gonna let old man Ram rest for you now. Why not? Oh, my bag can I? Yes, she has a bag now. Maybe she's given up on this place. Maybe she's found. She's off set to find her true love. What's going on, Asta? Blackthorn may be the manliest of men, but he does lack a certain tenderness. What do you want? Goops, 
Meanwhile is as burly as a behemoth, but as innocent as a babe in arms. So what do you want? So what do you want? What kind of... Do you want someone who has both? Go for Kupka then. Go, go for Kupka. Has the built of Goots. Has the manliness of Blackthorn. You got no hands anymore though. Girl, what do you want? Actually super curious about Torgo. Before we talk to Otto. Let me uh, talk to the tomes. I dread to think what happened in Rosalith. White as a sheet. Garen. Man, good is still talking to this guy. Oh, come on, Clive. Uh, I was worried I'd never see you again. <laughs> Holmes. Tom says he's looking for books about Torgo. Oh. I know. Let's write one. No, you can't. I mean, yeah, all right. I, I, okay, whatever. Yeah. Holmes is going to look into what happened to Torgo for us. You make sure he's not hurting himself doing, well, whatever the fuck it is he did. <laughs> okay, Tom, talk to me. My knowledge is yours. I don't believe you've read this particular chapter before. If you have a question for me, Torgo, what happened to him? Nothing yet. All right. Did you learn everything you needed? Torgo is a mystery, guys. What's your theory about Torgo? I mean, I really thought it was Car Carbuncle, but the thing about Carbuncle is he cast Protect. He did protect Jill, though, but that is not the that whatever he shot through his body is not. The nature of Garbuncle. How about you, Otto? What do you What do you think? Otto, is now a good time? It's not a bad one. Hmm. How's Jill doing? Oh, she's been better. Ty is making sure she gets the rest she needs. Good. Any word on Kupka's movements? Vivian's doing what she can to try and track him, but she's feeding on scraps. We've sent owls out to the curse breakers and our other friends in the west, asking them to keep their eyes peeled for anything unusual. Mm -hmm. No leads yet. But it's only a matter of time. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me know when you find something. There he is. Uh, wait, what? Ashley? Right, Clive. Still busy saving the world. Who the heck are you? Who's this Genki girl? Mid. Uh, when did you get back? Mid. She doesn't look mid though.